Hi, hey. Stephen. Hey. I think we're actually wearing the same clothing, except you're on the roof. So. I'm not wearing the same clothing. Uh, I am. Though this, the, the, all of the uh, uh, eight plus squad cars at Escobar. Yeah, okay. So I was wondering what all of the police activity outside was, and now I know. <laughs> um, active weekend in Atlanta. Super spreaders. <laughs> well, as you can see, I have uh, sort of rehung. I got some wall work to do. Yeah. All right, so we spoke um, roughly eight hours ago, something like that. Maybe ten yeah. hours ago. Yeah. Well, we were talking sure. about yesterday. Hmm. So, um, I, well, um, I know I know you started this morning. So. Um, I had a pretty good Sunday, honestly. Um, yeah. You know, um, spent a little time over at a, with a friend in the back garden. Took some sunshine in. Got some um, got some really really good vitamin D. I was deeply appreciated. Really enjoyed that. Yeah. Um, got a little painting time in today. Uh, and kind of genuine on that. I uh, did enjoy doing that. And also built a couple other fun things. Um, but yeah, I think for a Sunday and just kind of a um, you know kind of. Um, I guess the end of a week, beginning of a new week, all that stuff. But um, I felt pretty good. I felt pretty good about my good. weekend. Um, I definitely, definitely do feel like um, time is stretching right now. So days are feeling a little bit longer. And um, yeah, that's, I think that's a lot of, um, like I was saying earlier, it's like, I think if you want to, if you want to lengthen your life, just pay attention. And you know, so it's an idea. It's kind of funny, but it's like, you know, when you're, when you're actually being present in the moment a little bit more and kind of, um, Flowing through that way, there's um, there's a lot more that happens in a day, and I think it's just because you're 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 looking at it, and you're watching it, you're, you know. So, yeah, a little bit a uh, little bit philosophical today, but it's really good. I like it. I dig yeah. it. My light's still flashing, so I did not. <laughs> it's, it's it's less, but it's still flashing. So how are how are you? I mean, you didn't have um, you didn't have a marathon meeting at least today, so I know that that's no. No, I didn't. I got some good stuff done around the house. I got a, I got a nice workout in. I did do a small meditation. Um, and I'm going to do another one in a few minutes and get to bed on the early side. And um, the dogs are probably going to go crazy from the fire truck that just went by. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> I don't know how much of that comes through. But... Oh, that's what it is. What? Boys. Just upset that you just disappeared like that. You just completely faded into the stadium. Yeah. Um, all the magic, sweetie. People are going to realize that it's the ruse. You're not actually on the roof. They're going to We're just out. a hot mess. It's fine. <laughs> this is, this is, that is our roof. And I did get to spend a little time up there with um, some neighbors and some, a new neighbor who has moved in, which is great. And, um, but yeah, so that is, that is the roof and our garden which i'm looking very forward um i think starting next weekend i i am i i need to get some seeds started i'm going to be a little late on the seed starting but um i uh i'm, I'm really looking forward to that and it's funny that just you say that warmth oh i know because the neighbors that you saw today do have seeds for us that seedlings that they are willing to share and i told them that i'm going to get our seedlings going and that i'll get the second round of seedlings <laughs> well i mean i was actually the funny thing is i was going to make a reference to one of the things i had said uh, to greg earlier today is that uh, i think i may um i may experiment a little bit with you on the garden this year i don't know i think i might more take a little bit more of an active role more of a from a maybe finally learn how to not kill a plant but um no, I, was, I, was, I was just kind of more reflecting as I, I do love the garden up there i am um, yeah and we've talked about the years different projects up there whether it be potentially some, some irrigation or uh what have you but um even even with some of the planning but yeah i i think i may i think i may do some some of my growth time with you on the roof oh uh, look at that well you know i actually think that you could be very valuable on that because i think that um yeah i mean there's 
uh, obviously there's a lack of water and, and especially of if there's a way to, you know, kind of, again, like we have the big um, water barrel, but don't necessarily reclaim that water because we don't have a good way to do it. Maybe there's a way that we can figure something yeah, out because- We've got some industrious people in the building. I think, uh, yeah. I think a, a little bit of a, uh, Couple people to come together, I think, and um, to maybe figure some things for because it's not well. The thing that I'm just a matter of yeah. What I love about the rain barrel versus the water from the tap is that the water from the tap is treated, and with that, you know, even if even if the water was taken from the tap to the rain barrel, it could still then be treated to remove the chlorine which again is it, all of that's just gonna I, I put things in the soil to remove that yeah, yeah. and i'm always hopeful we get more rain that would be a more natural water than what's coming out of that tap so um you know i don't use a lot of I, we try to use almost no pesticides and anything so we do you know a lot of natural sprays and stuff to get rid of critters but i i think that'd be great so i'm game uh to be to be seen will this uh, turn into a gardening adventure <laughs> there is something seriously wrong with me and i blame this 45 minute thing a lot. Well, no no but it was it was funny I, I, my, my, my goal is to get to the point that i can actually earn the right to have a bonsai again because i really love fucking bonsai i just don't want to kill one more so I, I think i have to educate myself a little bit you know maybe take a cue from the 3d printing world of like it's a hobby <laughs> that you know perspective uh, has a lot of influence on in how you approach a task so um i don't know i just it yeah was, it was one of those thoughts that that hit today and i figured if uh, if anything else it hit in the meditation so maybe uh just throw that out there but nice all right i well, love it other than that um i feel like it's been a good day it's been a good day it was a it was a nice weekend up. even with a long board meeting it still was nice to connect with my brothers and to um you know get some work done so i uh yeah i'm not i'm not hating it and i've i'm setting myself up for a good week and i think um i always think that's super important to get, especially now that we're, you know, getting back into more of a normal schedule with you going into an office and um, it, you know, again, getting back on that regular schedule and the meal prep and stuff like that, self growth wise to me is a really big deal, like just preparing and uh, trying to figure out everything, all the little boxes and what you would like to get done and what you will get done and what's realistic to get done. And then what else falls out of the sky? What? And then whatever falls out of the sky. Well, that's true. All right. <laughs> well, I think we're good today. I think we're good. I love you and I'll see you in a few minutes. And uh... I'm just hoping that Jake is happy to be posted today. <laughs> and day 34 is done. All right, see you in a minute.